I really needed a small school and coming to York academic wise, I'm very glad I came. I really like the fact that I have teachers and professors that I can go to and talk to. They're pushing us not to the point of frustration, but just enough to help us succeed and push us to the next limit because they want us to be the best teachers that we can be. So my passion really is to make sure that, that they get the skills they need, the competencies they need, plus to be able to work well as a team member. You have to be caring, kind, thoughtful, involved. Uh, we're very blessed to have students who really do care and communicate well and uh, are, are really interested in learning. Part of that process at your college is getting students out in field experiences from their sophomore year clear up through the culminating activity of student teaching. But right now in the new program, they're actually integrating the field experience hours with the classes. I think the classes that we have to take are very helpful. Um, they get us out into the classroom very early on in our college career. Um, I was in the classroom doing field experiences my the end of my freshman year, so that was very helpful because I was able to see if this is truly what I wanted to do. Um, I've had field experiences in multiple settings, high school, middle school, elementary school, and special education. I get feedback from the teacher and you know that's good or bad. It helps me succeed as a student myself. When I see a light bulb moment when a kid gets something, I'm, I'm sharing in that moment and they're just happy to learn. You have to be dedicated to do this. It's almost like a lifestyle. I mean, teaching itself, it's not just a, okay, go to work and do it and then turn off the job at the end of the day. You go home, you write lesson plans and do all that kind of stuff. Making sure that they truly want this as a career because you're probably talking 30 to 35 years. And you have to want to be there. I mean, the kids are going to know if you want to be there or not. And if you show up and don't want to be, then they're not going to want to be either. So our, our job placement has been very, very high. Um, uh, the nine years I've been here, um, 90, 95 percent of the students have gotten jobs in a special education setting. Uh, last year, which was a tough economic year, all 10 that graduated last year uh, notified me that they had jobs. If you have dual major in special ed and regular ed, you're golden, you're going to get a job because that's what they're looking for. I think they're the best at what they do. They make it exciting. Yeah, I like that one.